Can you name Snow White's seven dwarves? Um, happy, Doc, Sneezy, Sleepy, Bashful, Dopey, and Grumpy. Can you name Snow White's seven dwarves? Are you serious? Sneezy, dopey, sleepy, grumpy, bashful, happy, doc. Can you name Snow White's seven dwarves? Happy, sleepy, dopey, grumpy. Um, sneezy. Uh, dopey. I already said that one. Sleepy? Did I say sleepy? Yeah. Uh, and I know I said sneezy already. Probably. Happy. It, it, jolly? I don't know. That would be happy. Um, bashful. Hello? Mm. Hello? Uh, I don't know. The last one always gets me. No, she's not here. May I okay. Keep her can you name Snow White's seven dwarves? Probably. You want to give it a try? No, that wasn't the question. The question was, can you? Okay. <laughs> can you name Snow White's seven dwarves? No. Probably like three or four, but that's it. I'm not going to count <laughs> three or four unless you actually no. say three or four. No. You don't know any of them? Uh, happy, Grumpy, Dopey, Doc, I don't know, Sneezy. I have no idea. I'm out, I'm out. Okay. Can you name Snow White's seven dwarves? Fuck. To know the answers of these, <laughs> and then not know the answers to the previous three questions, <laughs> it would be a terror. Like, I shouldn't know the answers to these. It's like sleepy, grumpy. Uh, and, uh, no, there's no grumpy, actually. Is there? No, there's, like, no, yeah. Well, can I want to say angry? That's not a name. <laughs> there's, like, sleepy. <laughs> <laughs> and you're looking at him. <laughs> All right, next question. <laughs> I thought I actually knew more than that, but I don't. <laughs> God, this is getting terrible. Michael's over here telling me. I should, but. I'm just giving you a second to make you look better. And more composed. Only only they give me easier questions. <laughs> this is like questions I would have had to Google <laughs> beforehand. <laughs> Alright, keep going. <laughs> Can you name Snow White's seven dwarves? Oh dear. You mean the Disney version? Yes. Because you know that that's the Disney. Uh Sleepy, Grumpy, Happy, Doc. Grumpy, happy, doc. Um, sleazy. <laughs> oh no, that's the eighth one. I'm sorry. Uh, given enough time, I probably could. Sleepy, grumpy, happy, doc, dopey. I I'm seeing their pictures in my head. Not only that, hi ho, hi ho is running through my head at the moment. Um, You're welcome. Sleepy, grumpy, happy, doc, dopey. I'm drawing a blank on the other two. Okay. It's been a while since I thought about the seven dwarves. Can you name Snow White's seven dwarves? Oh, I haven't. I haven't done Snow. I haven't watched Snow White in years. So, happy, sleepy, grumpy, dopey. Um, I give up. Sorry. <laughs> Can you name? Snow White's Seven Dwarves. Oh, Jesus. 
dopey, sneezy, grumpy. Oh man, dopey, sneezy, grumpy, dark. I think that's about it. It's seven. I'm only missing three. You're gonna have to tell me what they are afterwards because it's gonna drive me nuts. But sorry, I, I can't remember the other three. Can you name Snow White's seven dwarves? Oh, I think I can. Ah, uh, let's see. Sleepy, sneezy. Grumpy, happy, dopey. Also, oh, always those last two, I always forget. Yeah, I guess that's as far as I can go. I can't remember the other two, even though I watched the damn movie either today. You watched the movie today. Yeah. And you cannot remember all the seven dwarves that were in it. Yeah, because most of them didn't even have lines. Yeah, that's, yeah. Oh, Doc. Duh. <laughs> and here's that last one. Did he even have a line in the damn movie? No. That's why. <clears throat> okay, you got six? Yeah. Okay. Can you name Snow White's seven dwarves? Sleepy, grumpy, dopey, dog. Um, that's all I know, possibly. Sneezy? Is there a sneezy one? <laughs> I don't know. Okay. <laughs> that was the best I could do. Can you name Snow White's seven dwarves? <sighs> Grumpy, Doc, um, Sleepy. No, I can't. I, I honestly can't. Can you name Snow White's Seven Dwarves? Oh, wow. Um, <sighs> Happy, Sneezy, Dopey, Doc. Uh, grumpy, uh, bashful, and sunshine bear. No, um, <laughs> funshine bear is actually the name. No, um, who am I missing? Okay, you got me on that one. Okay. Can you name Snow White's seven dwarves? It's like he picked these out just to piss me off. I don't like Disney either. Uh, all I know is there's, what, the Grumpy and the Sleepy and the, or Snoozy, I don't know what his name is. Sleepy, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, I got two out of seven. That's, that's a good start. <laughs> Real world questions I should have known. Can you name Snow White's Seven Dwarves? Snow White's <laughs> Seven Dwarves? <clears throat> Start with the most obvious. Dopey, Sleepy, Grumpy, um, Doc, Don't help me out over here. <laughs> um, boy, I can only get four of the seven dwarves. I know that. I think I know. He's asking me, not you. Yeah. Okay. Can you name Snow White's seven dwarves? That's been a while. You might get me on this one, but I'll give it a shot. Um, Dopey, Grumpy, Sneezy, Doc, um, 
sleepy. Uh, okay, I'm stumped on the the other two. It's been a long time. I used to, I used to remember it. It's been a long time. Okay. Can you name Snow White's seven dwarves? Probably not. Uh. They're pretty much how I feel when I wake up in the morning. They're sleepy and dopey <laughs> and sneezy, sleepy, dopey, sneezy, doc. Um, and that's about, no, there's three more, aren't there? Sleepy, dopey, sneezy, doc. Uh, grumpy, grumpy, that's the other one I am in the morning. Um, and sleazy and derpy. <laughs> Pretty much sums up my life. Okay. <coughs> so, in other words, no. <coughs> I have a phobia about Disney anyway, and they sort of they've taken over all the good children's literature and folk tales and you know yeah. Disney. Fighting. I once did a psychological analysis of the Disney movie dynamic, and people were like, "Wow." Was it good? I didn't do a video. It was like a Facebook post, but it was talking oh. about, about how it, it... I I threw a bunch of stuff in there, like um, how it it promotes a, a, a de, like a sense of dependency of the female characters on the male characters. Usually the princesses will have one single parent or, or no parents. Right. And the one parent they do have will be temperamental, absent-minded, or otherwise indisposed of proper parenting. So, not parenting. Yeah, so it's kind of So like, they need a man to rescue them because they come from a dysfunctional childhood. I um, could choke that motherfucker for setting up that paradigm. Um, but it's in, like, a lot of them. It is. Look at poor Pocahontas. Mulan was pretty cool, but even she... Well, oh, she well. wanted. Well, I feel like I was so excited. They about still Pokemon mutilated and... that folks' tail. I'm told because uh, yeah, people say it's like way inaccurate. Oh, but um, another thing is that they're meeting up with these guys that they don't even really know, and you're like instantly in love, and there's this presumably happily ever after thing, and the thing is that now combine that with absolutely and only and see where you get the villains I, I feel like it's it's sort of prejudice against single parent family dynamics. exactly that's what i'm saying because the sort of uh negligence that they portray the single parent as having is what leads, leads them to this to be dependency in the, no it leads them into the clutches of the villain and then they have to have this right them. right because they don't know how to be independent and think for themselves and they get suckered in and yeah. Mm. So that's my Disney hypothesis. That's why you don't you didn't notice it, but I have Disney dolls, Disney princesses on my um, radio antenna on my truck. One of them oh. doesn't have a head. Oh. I found them in the dumpster. I I had to have them because I really hate them a lot. And being a genderqueer person, a lot of um, genderqueer and trans people, especially so-called male to female. Um, have this conversation about being expected to look like a Disney princess. The only people who get media attention in the trans and gender queer community are the ones that, I'm not saying they're bad people, you know, right. are the ones that fit the binary to the point where they look like supermodels. There is that. And then there's Chaz Bono. I have a friend, I have a friend who's trans, and he says it like, uh, he says it like, like this. There's this term in the transgender community for that, uh -huh. and it's called passing. Right. But he says it's it's fine if you're passing, but if you're not passing. But that's all the media shows, and so that sets that's up the thing the that if you look like a normal schlub, like you know, I'm wearing my girl clothes because it's I'm not going out here. God, I wouldn't even wear that. You know, you definitely look female. You know, but I wouldn't even wear that in this town. You know? Well, I've been mistaken for a dude in a skirt before. Oh, I used to get called I sir all so the time. I thinking to get out of that. Get a Scottish accent and tell him it's a kilt. Oh, well, I and got And threaten to beat skirt. him up with your axe. Something like that. Anyway. Oh, beat How did we get tomorrow. talking about princesses and grandsons? Oh, Disney movies. What was the question? Seven Dwarves? Oh. Uh, what's the I next I still one? don't know. Okay. <laughs>